The Trail of Dreamwalkers stopped in Richmond Thursday on their 1,500-mile journey from Miami to D.C. The walkers are rallying to change legislation to allow undocumented students access to higher education. The group was greeted by an enthusiastic group of VCU students and members of the Richmond community. The team walked with supporters downtown to the Capitol where they would have a news conference and meet with the Secretary of Education. The walkers spoke about their journey and their motivation. Uh, you know, we town to town, like, you know, we leave, our, we leave a mark and we, give, we try to give a good representation of uh, undocumented immigrants across the, uh, of the nation. Uh, there's an estimated over 12 million undocumented immigrants in this country and uh, 2.5 uh, million of which are undocumented students, such as ourselves. Uh, we're the four of us are college students and uh, at one point or another the four of us were undocumented. We're, uh, in my case, I'm still undocumented, Felipe is still undocumented, Gabby is still undocumented. And uh, we just want to, we just want a pathway to organization and be able to get back uh, to society. We've been walking because uh, we've been called criminals, we've been called aliens, we've been called all so many names, and uh, it's about time to stop. It's about time for immigrants to tell their own stories out of their own mouth, and um, and that we have to start somewhere. And we felt if it would have taken four, uh, four months, 1,500 miles, blister, blister fee, uh, broken, whatever, you know, whatever could have happened, we, st we decided that, that that was the step we are going to take. Trail of Dreamwalker Carlos Roa said the walk was made possible by contributions from their supporters. The thing that we have, like all the clothes, you know, the, ga the gas to pay for the RV, which is our support vehicle, um, you know, everything that we have, you know, even our shoes, our socks, everything has been uh, because of the uh, donations that we receive from members of the communities uh, that we go by. And uh, it's every day, it's day to day, you know, we make, uh, we collect uh, so that people can, so that this can keep on going. And, yeah, people have come through for us. And Among their supporters was VCU's Alpha Psi chapter of La Unidad Latina, the Latin Student Association, and Lambda Upsilon Lambda Fraternity. Ed higher education should be available for all students, uh, whether undocumented or not. Like they should have some sort of uh, uh, pathway to get into education because you can't you can't lose to educate people. Like it's just it's a win-win situation. After meeting with the Secretary of Education in Richmond, the Trail of Dreamwalkers continued on towards Washington, D.C., where they expect to arrive on May 1st and meet 6,000 supporters to rally for the cause.